Welcome back guys to a new Roblox Adult Me update video We're eventually into the final week of the Halloween update With only just 2 days and 20 hours left of the Halloween update But before we guys start, I hope you smash that like button If you have not, please subscribe to this channel If you subscribe on the red, make it break us that slow And let's hit 2.1k subs again With only just 1 subscriber away And then can we hit 2.11k before the end of this week? Hopefully we can, as it will be a dream come true and as well as I knew I said I won't be making any more videos since last Friday since last Friday's update video but I just have to as this week's update is a big one as it's another event that's gonna last up to two entire weeks meaning at least until probably sometime like 14th of November I know I started the video in a weird place not where I usually start either the lab or the on my house in the lobby. But in this week's update we get the Dia Dia de los Muertos update. It's technically Day of the Dead, but as celebrated in Eastern Europe and in Mexico. But in Mexico is different to what we how us Poles celebrate it in Eastern Europe. So let's get started. So here we have Jesse explaining everything coming in this week's Day of the Dead update but before we know what's coming is that i can give you a sneak peek that there's going to be three new pets but let's hear what jesse has to say jesse here we're in the last week of halloween but don't panic there's going to be a way to spend your candy even after the event ends this friday we begin celebrating dia de los muertos the day of the dead in adopt me a new wagon rolls into town and inside you can find three new pets for two thousand five hundred bucks you can so this is a new grey vowel pet for 2,500 bucks and it's an ultra rare meaning you would have to spend up to let me do the calculation quickly up to 10,000 bucks to make a neon meaning you better be saving up your bucks at the moment but there's something else that's actually gonna basically we mean for you to save up your candy as well so meaning this week you're going to have to save up both your candy and box so meaning both of them you collect the ultra rare gray vowel for 700 and then for 700 robux here we have the legendary sugar axolotl as we all know it looks this has to be the best pet so far that we have done for the first ever celebration of the day of the dead event like this is the first ever day of the day event in Adopt Me's history meaning could we be getting the next one next year hopefully we do because I know we sometimes run out of that ideas towards the end of the Halloween update but this we this year they've not as this event is actually a special event since if you if you're not used Eastern European you may not understand fully but you may do and if you're not Mexican you may not else but you can search up on Google and know the meaning of it. But this pet has to be the coolest one out of this entire update as well. Robux, you can collect the and it got 700 Robux, meaning if you want to buy, you need 2,800 Robux to make a meal. Legendary Sugar Axolotl. And they've also brought an ultra rare Golden Jaguar. You can unlock that by playing for 45... And in the jo Golden Jaguar, you have to play for 45 minutes every single day for 8 days to get one stamp each day. Meaning you have to play for at least a week and one day to get the, all of the 8 stamps. And then once you've collected those 8 stamps, you can eventually purchase it for purchase it again for 2000 bucks. Meaning if you want to make a Neon, you already will have one for free without purchasing bucks. All you just have to do is play 45 minutes every single day for 8 days straight. And then... You will get one stamp each day for eight days and then once you get all those stamps you have to go to the carriage and then apply it to whatever you need to do but we'll see in tomorrow's trailer and then you'll be able to get the Jack golden jaguar over and over and over again without the stamps just for bucks let's see what jesse has to say for more five minutes a day for eight days over the total 14 that the update is here Complete your stamp card and the Golden Jaguar is yours for free. 
For the first week, you'll also find Halloween items inside the wagon. There will be so, as you heard, the reason why I, I was saying save up your Halloween candy as well is because the ha some Halloween items are still going to be staying, especially the beds, only for one week. Meaning, not this week, but next week, those Halloween items will be gone, and then that's over. No more Halloween items at all, as the event will end on basically the 15th of, of November. So, you don't really have that much time, so you better save up your candy and use up the next entire whole week, not this, I mean starting from Friday, the next entire whole week, from the 1st to the 8th, and then next Friday they're all gone, meaning the dummy's gonna bring in more of the Day of the Dead pet, maybe new pets, maybe new vehicle, maybe new toys or something else that refers to Day of the Dead, that lasts two weeks, I don't, so as I said, this event will last two weeks from the 1st of November, this Friday, till the 15th of November, which is in two weeks' time. So, that means there's more to come in this event. Maybe a new house, maybe a new vehicle, maybe much more, but we will see in the upcoming few, in the upcoming next two weeks. A different selection of items available every 24 hours for you to spend either candy or Robux on. On November 8th, the Halloween items will disappear. So as Jesse said, every 24 hours there will be new Halloween items. It's either the ones that are actually available now in the Halloween event, or some new items. You never know. We'll see in tomorrow's trailer, as it's either Matt, Matt or Jesse that will be in the, in the trailer, explaining everything we need to know for Friday's update. And all of these rewards will refresh for 24 hours, every 24 hours for the next week and will go away permanently from next week. ...from the wagon, but the Day of the Dead pets will still be available until the update ends. Dia de los Muertos starts this Friday in Adopt Me. Visit playadopt.me slash countdown to see how long you have left to wait. So yes, search up playadopt.me, playadopt.me dot, I mean slash countdown to know when it releases for you. Well here we have the Adopt Me Influencer Ocean Lee. What she said is Dia, Dia de los Muertos, Dia of the Dead. There will be a wagon that moves around the Adopt Me map selling random items for candy corn, meaning this wagon will be moving around the map for the next two weeks. After one week, all Halloween items will be removed from the, this wagon. So every uh, Halloween item will be removed. And then here we have the rest of the pets so, Ultra Rare Grey Vowel, 2500 bucks, Legendary Sugar Axolotl for 700 Robux, then the Ultra Rare Jaguar, as we can see, it's gold, it's in its golden form. Ultra Rare Golden Jaguar for 8 stamps, play 45 minutes to get a stamp, one each day. Once you have unlocked your first Jaguar, then you can purchase more for 2000 bucks in the bag, meaning you can basically purchase it, purchase it, purchase it over and over again. Uh, from next Saturday so that's the predicted day that you can collect your first golden jaguar and then purchase it over and over again but here we have what else it only said from a tweet the wagon will be there in case people forget to spend the leftover candy which happens often you don't need to hold any back the new pets will be available for box, robux and playtime. So as I said, that's why all you need to know about the new Halloween and Day of the Dead update pets. So guys, that's it for today for this week's Halloween weekly news. This will be the last weekly news of the month and especially for the next entire month as I'll be eventually taking a break from possibly Friday. As Friday will be eventually the last day I will post a video which will be the update video for the Dia, Dia de los Muertos, which is Day of the Dead update, that come, update event that comes out this Friday. So guys, I thank for your support for the entire month. We unfortunately did not hit 2.5k but I hope we do by Christmas and if we do, thank you guys, you will be imaginary and helpful for your support so thank you for your support in these weekly news videos 
notes and I'll see you for the last time on Friday. Bye.